here and I hear a rooster. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of fog there and uh, probably some freezing fog in a few spots. Just a sign that we've got uh, a lot of frost out there as well. So again, make sure you're clean, uh, leaving yourself some time to scrape off the windshield. A very cold morning. Uh, we've seen mostly clear skies through the overnight hours. Winds going calm out. And that is a recipe for a cold night. And checking in this morning, we've got a lot of high thin cirrus clouds moving in from the west. They are here to stay. We're going to see a few more clouds around today. Still, though, a pretty nice day. I would actually say today is the pick of the week. Sunrise coming in this morning at 654. So today, the warmest day of the week. That's for sure. This afternoon, light winds as well. Should be a pretty nice day to uh, get outside, maybe get some fresh air if you've been holding off. Maybe it's been a little too cold for you for the last couple of days. Our next storm system arriving tonight and really comes in here Thursday morning. Initially, we could see some snowflakes mixing in with some raindrops. Uh, I think that's going to be somewhat slim picking. So as we move into the afternoon hours, expecting that to quickly turn over to rain and this is not even a big rainmaker for us. Friday the rain moves out, but the clouds stick around and some pretty cool weather still sticking around through the end of the week and into the weekend. This morning though, we've got some temperatures back into the teens. Benton right now at 19, Mount Vernon down to 16, Ridgeway and Harrisburg both at 19 degrees, Golconda you're at 17, Vienna at 17, and Marion down to 20 degrees. To the south into western Kentucky, lower 20s uh, primarily in their Mayfield at 21. Zalma, Missouri at 23 in Bollinger County, and we've got uh, Malden currently at 28 degrees. So as we go throughout the day today, mostly sunny skies. Lunchtime temperatures into the low to mid 40s this afternoon. We're going to on average be into the upper 40s. Could see a few spots uh, crack 50 degrees or so, primarily back in the Missouri boot heel. Tonight, clouds start to build in. So initially, we drop back into the upper 30s by 6, and then temperatures hold steady through much of the overnight hours, just below the freezing mark. So another cool start, though, as we move into Thursday morning. High pressure now to our east. Here's our next weather maker this morning, moving through parts of the plains. We've got some snow flying back into Kansas and Oklahoma. That snow is going to stay away from us, but they do have some winter storm warnings out across parts of southern Kansas and parts of western Oklahoma there early this morning. So they are actually seeing some accumulation in parts of the plain. Now this afternoon, again, we've got mid to upper 40s into southern Illinois and western Kentucky, a few spots closer to 50 back from Sykeston, Dexter, and and Poplar Bluff, but here we go into Thursday morning. Temperatures hovering about that freezing mark. I uh, still think maybe a degree or so above freezing, so primarily just some light rain. Notice though the white showing up here. So the best chances of seeing some of these snowflakes likely back into the higher elevations of the Missouri Ozarks, but then temperatures warm up pretty quickly through the morning hours. So we transition over to all rain and mainly light rain here into our region as well. So projected snowfall through Thursday, uh, not anticipating any accumulation in our region and rainfall amounts. It's just not a big rain rainmaker for us. Uh, most areas less than a quarter of an inch of rainfall. So about a 40% chance for some showers there on Thursday. We're dry on Friday, mostly cloudy skies and dry through the weekend as well. Some sunshine possible by Sunday. Temperature so back into the lower 40. Still running cooler than average even into the early part of next week. Some signs though by Tuesday. We're getting closer to 50 by Tuesday and maybe by Wednesday and Thursday of next week we'll jump into the lower.